John Hancock had a really big signature. And welcome to the another Welcome to Snacking on the Run. It's the weekend. And I found me some vanilla heat coffee creamer. Okay, maybe this isn't really a snack, it's just something fun for my coffee. Get a load of that. Looks like it's got red chili peppers in there of some type. Let's bust off the cap here. Man, they seal it hard. I don't know get why they do this. Why do they make this so hard? Finally! Man, they must be putting some freaking super glue on that. <clears throat> okay. Good thing is, I have a little styrofoam cup here. So now let's pour and see what it looks like. Ooh, it's all... It's all cream colored. Get a little more there. It smells like Ordinary coffee creamer. I don't get any smell of heat. Let's go. Oh, there it is. That's good. Gets you tingly on the bottom of your mouth, on your tongue, sides of your mouth. Then it gets you pretty strong on the back of the throat. That's a good tingle. A nice throat, throaty tingle. Actually, if I drink too much of this, I might start coughing and gagging. Um, this couldn't be hotter than cayenne, maybe. Worst case. But it is tempered, you know, moderated by all the, uh, the, co the creamer and the sugar. Actually, there's no dairy in here, I don't believe. I mean, that's gluten-free and lactose-free. So, um, there actually, there actually is no dairy in here. I think this is going to go great with coffee, and I'm going to give it a try pretty soon. But as far as the creamer itself goes, it tastes delicious. It's got that nice little kick of heat that's going to go really, really well for you spice heads, for you pepper freaks. If you can find this in your market, you're going to have a great time. Thanks for watching another episode of Snacking on the Run. Until next time, stay in school. Don't do drugs and eat like a freak. Yeah, I'm going to be drinking pepper coffee. I hope you guys like grapefruit as much as I do, because I'm going to be eating 10 of them. <laughs>